And once again, we're going to let Lady Luck and the fickle hand of fate determine the topic for a Section 5 feature. Tonight, Dan Fates heads the Churchville Childlight to prove that every team has a story. The whole reason we randomly draw a name out of a bucket and spin a wheel is to show that the biggest schools aren't the only place to find a good story. In fact, at Churchville Chile, we found the exact opposite. The Saints girls cross country team only has 10 runners and maybe the smallest team in all of Monroe County. Richard Strasser has been coaching for two decades and says it's the smallest team he's ever had. But you know the saying, it's not the size of the team in the race, but the size of the race in the team. Is that good or bad? It's the smallest team. By no means am I going to equate the biggest team is the best team. The team says during practice and on long runs, they'll sing songs together or tell stories to kill time, and that they enjoy the close knit feel and friendship that this small team has created. Because with a sport this grueling, it takes more than endurance. This season, I split the side of my spike right open and rolled my ankle, and I had to finish the entire race. So that was. It's pretty difficult. It's really a lifestyle because you have to stay hydrated and you have to have good nutrition and you have to get to bed, but you also have to keep your grades up. It requires a lot of like mental like pressure and thinking. There's so much that comes out of it between the way that it makes you push yourself and it sets you up for later in life. You're at a meet and the team does not beat any other team, but if they all set out and did exactly what they were supposed to do as best as they can, in my book, that's a win. You went to bed at a decent time, you had a good meal, you hydrated, there's a lot of things. If you did as best as your body can, they're learning you cannot have regrets afterwards. And we don't have to travel too far for our next story. We'll just head one town over. Reporting in Churchville, Chile, Dan Fates, News 8. We found the other Chile. Hey. And how silly is this? This is a random draw, school team or whatever. Mr. Strasser? He lives in my neighborhood. Our daughters go to the same school. Stacy's back after this.